All right, let's say you only have $100. You're probably gonna wanna know what's the best shoe that you can get for that price. And today's video is gonna show you exactly that. All right, hey guys, how are you guys doing today? My name is Aaron Ramirez. Thank you guys so much for catching today's video. If you guys are new around here, I make videos about fashion and fitness. So if that does sound intriguing and you guys wanna see more of that, make sure to subscribe. I would really appreciate it. But like I said, today's video is all about the best shoes that you can get for $100. Because I always talk about money does not equal style. And today's video is gonna be a prime example of that. Also, something else that you guys might have noticed if you guys have been subscribed to me. I finally cut my hair and it has been a very long time since I've cut my hair this short, but I'll speak more about that in the end of the video for those of you guys who are interested. Make sure to stay tuned for that. But without wasting any more time, let's get into the list of the seven shoes that are great for $100. The first one on the list is gonna be Tailwind 76s. These are some Nike shoes that are very underrated. You don't see a whole lot of people rocking these shoes, so it definitely will make you stand out if you guys get these shoes. They retail for $90, and in my opinion, it's one of the best shoes that you can get for under $100, especially nowadays, where because most shoes retail like over $150. So this one is perfect if you want to style on a budget. Number two, Adidas SC Premiers. Now the ones that I have are an off-white. They're actually sitting in a box right in the corner of my room and I'm so excited to unbox those that's gonna be the next video but like I said if you guys are new to this channel and you want to see those on feet and you want to see an unboxing make sure to subscribe because that's gonna be the next video uploaded to this channel these retail for $80 but I bought them on go and they're under retail so if you guys wanted to pick up these shoes right now it's gonna be the best time to do that because they're under retail on the go app Number three, Reebok Club C85s. This is another great shoe for under $100. This one costs $75. So it is definitely a great bang for your buck. And this is also a very versatile shoe. And if you guys have noticed, all of these have been pretty like versatile shoes and they're also not really ones that i usually talk about these all go great with that vintage vibe that i have been playing around with and i'm gonna make videos about that i've always talked about how it's a good idea to rock some minimal clothes and why like casual aesthetics are really good but but something that i just realized is it's very cool to have versatile aesthetics so so switching up from aesthetic to aesthetic that is something that i have been enjoying recently it does get pretty boring sticking to one thing so definitely play around and see what what suits you so these shoes will have the the 90s vintage aesthetic that I'm talking about and it'll also have that minimal aesthetic just in case you don't want to switch up there's definitely gonna be some shoes for that as well the next one on the list is gonna be Converse Chuck 70s now these I really love because they're slightly different from the actual Converse that most people wear so it, this definitely will make you stand out because it's like a it's like a step up of normal Converse and this one goes perfect with either aesthetic that vintage aesthetic and that minimal aesthetic definitely goes great with either one. But yeah, pretty versatile shoe if you ask me. I definitely recommend it. This one retails for $80. Number five on the list is going to be Nike High Top Blazers. Now blazers are definitely coming back. I have been seeing a lot of them recently. And if you're on TikTok and you have and you follow like fashion TikTok, you see these a lot. Most fashion pages that I watch on TikTok pretty much every fashion tiktoker or whatever they're called are rocking these shoes and they do style it a lot so i definitely see that they are very versatile and they retail for a hundred dollars so it's a good bang for your buck number six is going to be adidas dan smith now i have always talked about this shoe because it is such a great shoe very versatile the look is timeless and it's perfect for that minimal aesthetic and you could dress this shoe up or you could dress it down entirely up to you it's overall just a great shoe and it's not really like a trendy shoe it's just something that looks good so if you buy these shoes they're only $90 if you buy these you can wear them in its entirety and you won't have to worry about the that trend dying because honestly these adidas stan smiths will never go out of style so definitely is a great option for that number seven nike blazer low now i talked about the high tops but the low tops are honestly just as cool and i definitely recommend it and they're also 10 bucks cheaper than the high tops these retail for 90 dollars. so if you like the aesthetic of the blazers and you want something just a little bit cheaper these are a good option or if you're just into low top shoes more that is also a great option I really like low top sneakers because you could wear them with no show socks and no show socks itself elevate your outfit so i definitely recommend playing with that and this would be a perfect shoe to also play around with that if you wanted to try that look out as far as colors go you can pretty much choose any color you want but i do recommend that white and black because that goes with everything but yeah anyways guys those are the seven shoes that i recommend for under a hundred dollars all these shoes very versatile, they look great, and of course, they are all budget friendly. They're all under $100, so I definitely recommend picking up any of these, whichever you like best, 
But anyways, guys, that's it for that. But if you guys are interested in me talking about my new hairstyle, I'm going to be doing that right now. So if you guys have been following me for pretty much any time, like you can check through all my videos. It has been a very long time since I've had short hair. And the reason for that was because I was really insecure about my ears. If you guys noticed, they're like sticking out. But honestly, I figured it was time for me to, you know, embrace my ears kind of stand up to those insecurities because you know everyone has their own insecurities and i always talk about how you should be confident despite any of them so i figured I should practice what i preach and i decided to you know just shave my head and honestly i'm pretty happy on how it turned out this is something that i've wanted to do for a very long time like i said i'm really happy with the outcome let me know if you like it for those of you guys who are interested i like i, ha I basically have like a four on the sides and i kept the top pretty long i pretty much didn't cut anything i super chopped up so it gives it like that cool texture if you guys want a video of how to style this hair i'll definitely be more than happy to do that but yeah anyways guys that's it for today's video so i hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did make sure to leave a like i would really appreciate it but anyways other than that guys i'll see you guys in the next video Later.